Hey guys, Mariah here, and why am I talking about a British accent? I don't know. I really love British accents, so. But anyway, um, today I'm doing an American Girl house slash room tour. Um, this, the entire structure is actually based off of a hockey table. <laughs> um, we used to play air hockey, but we don't anymore. So that's what it's being used for now, so let's get started. Okay, so the first room you get to when you look towards it. Um, I'm not quite finished with this one because I just finished creating this area, but I made this table, so you can see it has legs and everything, and four dolls you can fit, like six, but I prefer only put four on it, but four dolls can fit on here, and it's really silky and soft, and Nikki's sitting right there, and Kit's outfit, I don't know why. Um, anyway, uh, over here, I just have this thing that I got when I was like six, it was for like the original beach set or whatever. And it's supposed to say raspberry flavored water, but it was misprinted and I couldn't read when I was that little. So I never really realized until I got everything out when I was older and started playing with it again. And then I have just a bunch of Iwaka erasers. It's like a sushi set and they're on a shiny plate. She's eating, apparently. And then I have, I got these from printmini.com and I just made two little cereal boxes and then an empty duct tape roll. And then there's a plate right there. All right, moving on to straight across from there, we have um, Paris and Marisol's room. Their room is sort of connected. Uh, here, let me just like detach her from this. Okay, I'm just gonna set her up here for now. Okay, so right over here, I have this pillow and coconut, which I got from my friend, or no, I found them at a yard sale for 50 cents. Um, that's why it's really dirty and stuff. And then I have these little food bowls and a little magnet that's in uh, bone shape. And then this is the Journey Girls Loft Bed. I highly recommend it. I got it for my birthday this year and I absolutely love it. Um, there's a fuzzy rug that the loft bed came with. And here you can see me and my iPod and this cat mirror that I made when I was little. There's a random box from Paris's birthday party. And here's her Just Like You necklace. It only has two charms. It has the Smart Heart charm and the Confident Square charm. Um, this stuff accepts the little portrait of McKenna right there, um, came with the loft bed, it's that bookshelf and the television, and then there's a build a bear dress back there that actually fits on if you tie it up in the back. Um, there's a bean bag chair, and I have her school bag and her purse right here. Her school bag is empty, except there's a binder in it, except I'm not going to bother to take it out because it's not that important. Okay, I just wait here, let me climb up here so I can do everything better. Okay. As we get to the top, um, the ladder, as you go up the ladder, we have our bed. Um, it actually didn't come with a mattress, so I, I found a, be a mattress that I was using for my video baby a long time ago. No, 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 it was a different one than I found. But um, there's a pillow that is just um, a white pillow that I put that little charm on. And then these two pillows came with it. Um, came with the comforter and the blanket. And I made this bulletin board back here. There's a calendar for the month of July. Um, there's a things to do. Um, a little note from her mom and a card that says get well soon. And then at the end, which I call her nightstand because she doesn't really have anywhere to have a nightstand. She has her two-tone glasses, which I absolutely love. This little mirror, I made her out of a piece of a CD. And her glasses case. Okay, now as we swivel around, so I can get into a better position to continue showing you. Um, there's some purple fuzzy dice that I got at Dollar Tree. And I just think they're really cute. Um, a postcard pet. And then this is something that I made not too long ago. Um, it's out of a pet, a Lilith's Pet Shop box, as you can see. But um, it's a, it has Paris' name on it. And then it says tops and bottoms. She has her tops over here and her bottoms over here. And I made that out of a box and duct tape. Um, and then the last... Oh, okay. I forgot about this part. This is the chair that I made her. It's out of two duct tape rolls and some cardboard. Um, I don't know why I made it. Probably because that chair is really tiny. But anyway, um, there's Marisol's energy bar. Another little mirror that I made out of a CD. I like making them. They're fun. Um, and then here's her laptop. Let me put that down. And she has notebooks, letters, diaries, makeup, which I got from Kitsy KK's tutorial. And um, a little eraser soda. There's some water and a lollipop hairband thing. And then this is the other half of that desk. 
And then I made this little fish out of a little cup, except the fish looks really fake. So I'm gonna make it again, but then her fish goes up there. So here's an overview of her half of the room. As you can see, from that would slide back in under there. And then there's a collage that my friend made me, and then there's another one that Adair made me. Okay, and then we move on to Marisol's half. Oh, and all their shoes are down here. We have Marisol's kitten, um, Rascal, uh, a rug that came with Molly's bed. Um, this is out of Paris's box. Um, I just put it on top. There used to be a shelf right here, but I took it down because it started sagging. Um, her bed is made out of the bottom of the box down here, a bitty baby mattress, a bitty baby blanket, and I tied both of those down, and then just an upside down bitty baby comforter. I know it's a lot of bitty baby stuff, but I played with that a lot when I was little. Um, and then she has three pillows. This one isn't actually a pillow, but these two are. And then just a little stuffed cat because she's the youngest. She's like eight in my American Girl world. And then here's another box that I made as a clothing trunk. And this one is out of a box that I got in the apology set in. And all of her clothes are just in there. And then I made this dress out of duct tape for her. And it has Velcro on the back and everything. It looks better when it's not lying on the floor. But, alright. Let's move on downstairs as we drop down. Okay, now this part is going to be quite dark under here. But I got these lights at Dollar Tree. And they stick to the ceiling. So, and then you just press them on, but I don't have batteries for them. I got two of them, one for this side and then one for this side. This is Kit and Nikki's room. Um, I'm sorry, my mom is working or whatever. And you see the hallways right there. So, anyway. Okay, so first thing I have, um, this is one of the pet traveling things. I'm sorry, she's so loud, I'm so mad. Um, say hi to YouTube. Anyway, she's clean, cool. Uh, anyway. But uh, this is one of the pet carriers. I have two of them because the first one I got was messed up. And it was like, um, it didn't come with a blanket. I'm sorry, this is really hard to open. Let me put the iPod down. Okay, um, when you open it up, thank you. Sorry, I had to give that to my mom. Okay, it has all of kids clothes in it and then there's a couple of Nikki's in the front but that's the majority of kids clothing um, and then I created this little thing out of a dress because they don't ever wear it I don't know why I just never put it on any of them and um, <laughs> Nikki imaginarily will press a button on her desk and then this will lift up and go across the room so Grace can hop out onto Nikki's bed um, I don't know why I made that. It's just interesting. And then, uh, Ginger and Grace are down here and there. Um, here, oh, I can turn this light on. It didn't go on. Don't tell me the battery's out. Okay, there it goes. Um, here I have Kit's phone, a picture of Grace back there, and her light. A K on the wall, and then Kit's bed and bedding. And she's actually wearing, we have Cavalier King Charles Spaniels. So she's wearing this little um, thing that you put around their ears to keep them from getting water. It's Halloween themed, even though it's really early. It just makes a cute little strapless dress. She has some more clothes back there because I have so many clothes. <laughs> um, here's a little thing I got at the North Carolina State Fair that I made when I was like seven. Um, there's a bag down there and then just a couple extra things and a little rug. Uh, and then here's her Cincinnati Register paper. I got her typewriter set also for my birthday. Oh, and I made most of this stuff. You can probably tell, but like, oh, and here's some fuzzy dice randomly hanging from the ceiling. Squisher. Um, I made most of this stuff because American Girl is really expensive. Um, I have Kodak film. Um, this should be her camera case, I think. I'm sorry, I'm trying to do this with one hand. Okay, yeah, it is. This is my favorite piece of the typewriter set. Just because it's so detailed um, and fantastically adorable. Here. Um, I just think it's really cute. I'm not going to try to close it because it, oh my gosh, it closed by itself for the first time ever. Okay, put that back in there. And I have her typewriter, um, which I got like two years ago. Oh, that fell. Oh well. And then the other part of her reporter set is just there's a no uh, little notebook in here. Let me pull that out. Do, 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 do. Wow, this is going to be a long video. But it's just a little notepad. And then, here, I'm not going to put that back in. She has this little tiny pin. 
and the cap comes off of the pin, as you can see. That's pretty cool. Sorry about that, I had to put that away. And then I have this jewelry box that I got when I was little, which I use as their dresser. And in where you're supposed to put the necklaces, I have her extra typewriting paper, um, a notebook, and her Robin Hood book. And they all go in there. And then the top door doesn't ever open. I wish it would, though. Uh, it's because this top part opens when you take everything off so it won't spill. This top part opens, and then there's a mirror and a ballerina. And then in here, I just have all the hair clips. See? Bye. Pretty platypus. Anyway, um, I just put that stuff back. Then uh, in the first drawer, I just have her purse. Uh, kids purse, some sunscreen, and, really, and her DSi that I made out of some cardboard and Google images. I still have to get a bottom for it, though. Okay, and then in the third drawer, uh, I just have two of the little squinkies. Uh, it's a pink and purple dog, and then a white Maltese. At least I hope it's Maltese. And then I just have a sweater. I don't know why a sweater is in there, but it is. So I'm going to put it back. Okay. Let me just put that drawer back. And the bottom, really? Okay. <laughs> the bottom drawer just has um, Nikki's laptop. And it has AG on it, even though I still haven't finished it. But then there's the Pet Shop sticker on there. And then a sparkly hair pick. Because Nikki has curly hair. Um, and I really want Caroline. She is the most beautiful doll I've ever seen. And then this is just a little rug. I got a, I got two of them for a dollar in Dollar Tree. And I just think they make really cool rugs and stuff. Uh, the other one's in the kitchen. But, um, anyway. And then Nikki's half of the room is Molly's bed. Because I, Nikki was my first doll. I got her when I was six. I know. You're supposed to be eight. Well, I really don't care. <laughs> um, but yeah. Uh, Sprocket's up there. And, wait, no, yeah, I got her when I was seven. Either six or seven, because she's the 20, uh, 2007 girl of the year, and I'm, and I'll be, and I'm 12. I turned 12 in July. Um, and then Sprocket's up there, and then there's an end on the wall. Uh, there's a TV right here, which is sort of all the way around the room. Oh my gosh, I forgot this part. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And then in here, there isn't anything in the top part, and in the bottom, there's just her fancy hair ties, and, um, there's some pencils and a pencil cup. And the TV remote. Sorry about that. Um, and then her bed. Very simple. Um, and then there should be some stickers. Yeah. I don't know why these stickers are here. I know, like, a long time ago and everything. But this was supposed to be on my DS when I got the game when I was, like, seven or six or whatever. And then those are just some random stickers that are on the bottom of the bed. And we had to wash it because my cat peed on it, so now it doesn't fit in the mattress. Um, back here she has her nightstand. It's a mason jar that I got at Bible school like two years ago. Um, this is her iPad. Uh, it's actually the print off for an iPhone, but it makes a perfect American Girl iPad. Um, and then she has her clothing bag, which I showed you that one. So it's the same thing. And then she has her beach bag. For some reason these two girls have beach bags. I don't know why. There's another mirror, which is this is her like vanity area. Um, she has her two squinkies that she has. I have them taped down because they keep falling over. Um, an Easter edition hex bug. Some makeup. Uh, a um, tiny, tiny stapler. It's like the perfect American Girl size. Except, I don't know where the staples are. Well, I think I do. I smell like gas or something. Oh, well. Um, well, that's probably not a good thing to just say, oh, well. But anyway. Um, then she has two little glass figurines. A pencil and a pencil cup. These are the first pencils that I made, so they're really bad. They just have little black tips on them. And then that's just um, a Benduru pencil cut. Uh, a hair clip. And then her composition book that I made when I was younger. Um, and then there's a square taken out of it for some reason. But yeah, there's that. And it's on an American Girl box. Oh, and then this is her pet chicken. Peeps or peeps a lot when you put them on your hand. I got them at Food Lion. Yeah, he's like motion censored or whatever. I don't know. He's worked for like four years. I'm expecting him to die at any moment. Um, most of their shoes are here. And then here's a jacket. 